Hi students, so I myself Shansan Shaji. So today's class will be focusing on uh, this is a small request given by few of the students. That's the reason I'm doing this video for everyone. So majority of the time during exam time, especially social science exam, the last and final question will be relating to map work and, which, and most of the schools every question paper asks for five marks and uh, every student faces one of the major problem or barrier is they are not able to mark the exact state so today's class in this particular video we are going to learn six major tips so that you will be able to mark the correct location at the current places so which are the major locations and which are the major states that you need to focus and you need to mark and um, few of you will not be able to remember all the states so today we'll be focusing on which are the major states and we'll be also focusing on some of the major tip to remember it so six major tip what we are going to analyze for learning the map work as are the following the number first tip you need to focus is that is relating to kk the second tip what i'm going to give you is very simple word same like kk you need to remember that is mm and the third tip what i'm giving you is that tat okay and the fourth tip i'm going to give you is this will be very simple tip and you will not forget this particular tip that is you know cow then you know dj right and put it djb that's it so now the fourth tip is completed now moving to the fifth tip fifth tip is very simple uh, even if you see google you will be able to remember gdoc url you know you will study in computer url and you know what is the phone number so we use phone number period so i will give you what is the explanation of each term determines so put a square to g then u as well as h so that we'll be able to mark everything and the last and final tip what i'm giving you is seven sisters plus one brother that is sam with a tn that's it so this is his sister seven sisters as well as one brother that we are going to focus this on yes fine and right so now as the right time for marking the major places on the map okay over to the map if you focus on so first tip what i've given you is kk so do not forget so towards the india's map towards the southern side there comes the kk this is kerala and this is karnataka do not forget the first tip what we are marking is kerala as well as karnataka so these are the two places that we are marking this is kerala and this one is karnataka the second tip what we are marking is mm mm means over to the top of karnataka that is what we focus on mm this is maharashtra and this is madhya pradesh so do not forget this is maharashtra and this is madhya pradesh third factor we are focusing is tat so tat comes over to this particular region tat that's it simple tamil nadu andhra pradesh and to what you have telangana so tat that stands for tamil nadu andhra pradesh and Telangana. So do not forget. So we are completed marking this particular portion. That is start with Kerala, Karnataka. Then we discuss about two mm. That is Maharashtra, Madhya Pradesh. Then third tip we focus is that T A T T A T Tamil Nadu, Andhra Pradesh, and Telangana. So I hope you got an understanding about the three major factors. That is K K M M and T A T. Now we focus on Cow D J P. Okay. Now over to cow DJB is very simple. Over to this particular region is where we are going to mark the cow DJB. C O W. This is C stands for Chhattisgarh. Okay. And now over to here, C O O stands for Odisha. Early it was known as Orissa, now it is known as Odisha. And over to here you need to mark the the third one. W stands for West Bengal. Do not mark West Bengal over to here. Majority of the students get confused and they used to mark West Bengal over to here. This is not West Bengal. This is Bangladesh. So when you mark West Bengal, make sure that the West Bengal lies towards this particular region. Do not forget C O W. So C stands for Chhattisgarh, and O stands for Odisha, and third one W stands for West Bengal. And we focus on D J B. D is not exactly over to here. D you will be able to find it over to this particular region. This is the capital of India. That is Delhi. So D stands for Delhi. 
So one of the important things that usually exam history has and uh, it is a unit therapy. So I just want to mention that particular point also over to here. Then we focus on JB. JB is very simple. So CRW, this is J and B. That is nearer to the West Bengal, it is Jharkhand. And over to the top, we have got Bihar. So these are the major places. I'll repeat C O W J B. C stands for Chhattisgarh. O stands for Odisha. W stands for West Bengal. J stands for Jharkhand. As well as B stands for Bihar. Okay, now I hope you got an understanding about the fourth major tip what I have given you that is KKMM, TAT, and CAO BJP. Now, this is the most confusing part and this area is where majority of the students lose their mark. So, why do people lose their mark or why do students use to lose their mark is because of a bit confused and confused mindset. Okay, over the G, you have got two G that you need to focus on. So, so always focus on where my hand moves on. Put your hands over to here and over to the small portion. Are you able to see a small portion of this particular area? Okay, over to this area is... Goa and over to this area is Gujarat. So Gujarat lies over to the major western region and this particular region is Gujarat and one more G that lies as over to here that is known as Goa. So Goa and Gujarat. So Goa is not a state but it is your own territory and Gujarat is this particular region is Gujarat so do not forget this is G and I have put over to here G square stands for two G's are there one is Gujarat and second one is Go and now you have given two major U. So over to this particular region that is after Bihar, near to the Bihar only lies the UP. So this is UP and it stands for Uttar Pradesh. And over to the top of Uttar Pradesh, we have got Uttarakhand. So two U's are there one is UP, Uttar Pradesh, and second U we discuss is Uttarakhand. So these are the major two U and R. As this particular region is where R, it lies for it is a region called as Rajasthan, and this is where we find more desert within India. And then we discuss about Ladakh. Ladakh means this is the region of Ladakh. Majority of your students they used to mark this as the Jammu and Kashmir. It is strong. This particular region is Ladakh, and Jammu and Kashmir lies over to this particular region. So do not forget this is Ladakh. And this one is J that is stands for Jammu and Kashmir. So this is LJ. I forgot to write on J. So this do not forget this particular factor. So Ladakh is over to the top and then comes the Jammu and Kashmir. So please you focus on this particular region. Do not forget. I repeat once again. This particular top region is the Ladakh and over to the down region it is Jammu and Kashmir. Then we discuss about PH square. P means it is over to this region that is down over to here is P. P stands for Punjab and these are the two H that we are discussing that is called H square. Over to the top H it is Himachal Pradesh HP and over to the down it is Haryana. So these are the major things or major of the state that you need to focus and the things of the tip what I have given you. So do not forget these all the things and what I have given you. So we have completed all the major region except this particular region that is over to the seven sisters. And now moving on to Sam PN over to Sam. This is S stands for Sikkim. It is the brother for all the seven sisters. This is where the Sikkim is. Do not mark Sikkim over to here. Some of the students they used to mark Sikkim over to here. This is Bhutan. So please do not mark Bhutan as Sikkim. Sikkim is a small place over to here. Okay, fine. And now coming to the major discussion over to here. This is Sikkim S. And there are two A. I have marked A square over to here. And let me mark 3M. So there are two A and three M's up there. So two A means the first A is AP, Arunachal Pradesh, down of AP you have Assam. So don't forget, over to the top you have got AP, that is Arunachal Pradesh, and over to the down you have got Assam. And then we are going to discuss about M means there are three M's over you need to focus on. The first M you need to focus is Meghalaya. Meghalaya means it will come down of Assam. Over to this region is only the Meghalaya. Over to this particular region, Meghalaya. And then comes near to the if you see towards this Meghalaya this particular region 
over to this region as Manipur. So you don't forget this one is Meghalaya, this one is Manipur, and this one is Mizoram. So this lies over to this particular region. So you can see this 3M is lying near close to close. So this is Meghalaya, this is Manipur, and this is Mizoram. Meghalaya, Manipur, and Mizoram. Mizoram lies towards the dead end over to this particular region. This is Meghalaya, Manipur, as well as Mizoram. Now, two more places you need to mark as, as T as well as N. T means it stands for Tripura. Tripura lies over to near to the Mizoram. So this is Tripura. Nagaland comes airport to Manipur. So this is where Nagaland lies. So these are the major tips what I need to give you as a map work tip for you as an overall tip for getting marks or scoring good marks in map. So make sure that you remember all the major tips and write down the tips and please to mark this tip. Take my word, you'll be able to complete marking all the major studies of the map and map of India within a fraction of five minutes. Within five minutes, you'll be able to thoroughly understand and complete studying all the major places of the seeds as well as uh, new videos coming relating to the capital. It is much easier than the marking of the state. So stay tuned. God bless you all. Take care. Bye.